We learned a lot from our club last weekend, uh, good, bad, and indifferent. You know, we had some moments there that we won and that were really exciting for our guys to, you know, show some growth throughout the season to be their best at this point. And that, that's a good thing, po very positive moment uh, for some guys. And then we had some things that, you know, showed up that hadn't yet, you know, some, uh, you know, bullpen issues that we felt that, you know, guys should have been better prepared to come in and get their job done and some defensive breakdowns and things. So we're, we're still working as a ball club to clean some things up. And last weekend was indicative that uh, we still have a little ways to go. Our guys never worry too much about individual awards, but it, it is a special deal that we had back-to-back -back Big West Players of the Week. You can't, it can't go unrecognized that uh, it's an indication that, you know, we're moving in the right direction. We're getting, you know, kids in here that can compete in, in this league and at this level. And, you know, getting more of them is, is, the, is, the, is the trick and the key moving forward to continue to bring in quality talent. But having back-to-back -back Big West Players of the Week is a really difficult thing to do for any program. Uh, and so, you know, we're, we're proud of that. We're proud of those guys. And uh, we want to collectively ha have that uh, help us uh, play better as a ball club. And, and hopefully it inspires everybody around here to keep working hard. We've been working hard at developing our front end pitching and the starters and, and some of our key relief guys and, and, and closers. So having those three guys start in a ball game right now, we have confidence in that. Uh, you know, they've been, they, they haven't been, you know, perfect, you know, in any one outing. They've had some great outings, but, you know, we want to see consistency uh, out of those three guys. And up to this point, we've, we've seen, a, we've, they've done a pretty good job at that. Uh, we, they need to continue that grind and keep getting better. Uh, we, we'll, ho our hope is that they get us through the fifth and we can move into that bullpen and, and those guys come in and, and do their job as well and hopefully get to a guy that wants to shut the door for us. Yeah, we consider this a 30-game tournament in the Big West. You know, we're, we're right in the middle of it. We have, we're three games in and uh, we have three to go this weekend and we're, we'll take them one pitch at a time. Uh, but getting out of the gate is important. You know, you want to win that Friday night. You want to win uh, in the beginning of, of, of league play. You know, you want to separate yourself if you can. And uh, we feel that if we play good baseball this weekend, we have a chance to, to take a series against a quality Fullerton team. And, uh, you know, so our, our objective this weekend is to win the series and, and hopefully separate ourselves in conference play. They're a quality ball club. You know, it's Cal State Fullerton. There's a, there's a reason they, they, they bring their best and, and, and play great baseball. They're sitting in, in one of the, you know, baseball capitals of the world right there and they've done a great job of establishing a long traditional program and uh, there's no they're no there's no different now they've played a great schedule uh, they're gritty they're tough they like to throw a lot of strikes uh, you know they'll, they'll be a good team and so you know we want to give them all the respect in the world and and uh, you know we we feel if we play our game and we just stick to what we're good at uh, we have a chance to win the series <laughs>